Persecution of the Jews After rebelling against Roman rule, the Jewish people went into exile. Toleration in their new lands was followed by severe persecution. During CE 66 to 73, the Jews of Judea fought against their Roman rulers. The Romans massacred many, and in 70 CE, destroyed the great temple of Jerusalem. Jews were barred from entering Jerusalem under penalty of death. In CE 116, Jewish rebellions in Roman-controlled Egypt, Cyrene, and Cyprus were also crushed. There was a continual unrest in Judea. During the Second Jewish Revolt in CE 132 to 135, hundreds of thousands of Jews were massacred or sold as slaves. Jerusalem was razed to the ground, and the Romans built a new city on the site, naming it Ailea. Capitolina, on the mountain where the great temple had stood, was a new temple dedicated to Jupiter. Survivors were driven from Judea to join established communities in Babylon, Anatolia, Greece, and northern Africa. The diaspora, or dispersal of the Jewish people that began with the Babylonian exile in 586 BCE, grew in momentum. After Constantine, Christian Romans became increasingly intolerant. They expected Jews to become Christians, and in the 400s downgraded their citizenship. Some Jews moved even further away to Germany and Spain. They established small, close communities in cities, keeping to their own traditions and maintaining contact throughout international networks. As a result, the two great Jewish traditions arose. The Ashkenazic Jews in um, sorry, Ashkenazic Jews in Germany, whose popular language was Yiddish, and the Shepherdic Jews, whose language was Ladino. European anti-Semitism. In medieval Europe, Jews could not own property or join armies. Instead, they became skilled craftsworkers, doctors, and traders. Eventually, they were allowed to be money lenders, which was forbidden for Christians to do, who considered lending money uh, sin. Kings and traders uh, protected the Jews who provided this service. Ordinary people, however, resented that they saw as an affluence during uh, generally hard times. And there's an interesting side note to this, that um, in medieval times, sometimes attacks on the Jewish communities, because of that whole protection and the whole money lending thing, attacks on Jewish communities were not uh, sometimes motivated by anti-Semitism, but more as a way to... Uh, rebel against the king without actually rebelling against the king by attacking the Jews that he protects. It's a very odd phenomenon that happens in Europe. By 1100, the Crusades had begun and feeling toward non-Christians had hardened. Across Europe, people turned against some Jews and forced them to live in particular areas of the cities called ghettos. Many others were persecuted and exiled from their homes. Thousands of Jews were killed during the Crusades, which lasted from 1092 to 1215. Jews were also expelled from England in 1209 and from France in 1306. Many fled from Spain and Germany to Eastern European countries.